what would you like to tell your fans that have remained loyal to you through past problems, through since you went to the Bettendorf camp, have come back? What would you like to tell those fans that are really uh, kind of in awe tonight? I just want to apologize to my friends, my family, and uh, my fans. Uh, I made some bad choices, and I basically just want to move on and put this behind me. I wanted to read a quote. You talked about amateur fighters and guys that do the amateur thing, and you say, I mean, those guys give the sport a bad name, and they make uh, professional fighters like us look bad because we're professional athletes. Do you feel like a hypocrite? No, I, I mean, I think everybody makes bad choices, and uh, I think all you can is just learn from your, from your mistakes and move on. From your past situations that you have been in, did you ever see yourself getting in something like this again? Well, I don't even want to talk about that. Is there any fear that this latest deal will end your days in the UFC? Uh, I don't know. I don't know yet. It's uh, all up to the UFC at this point. There's nothing I can really do, so uh, I just got to sit back and uh, hopefully uh, they let me fight and uh, I move on from this and uh, no more troubles. What would you say to folks that say you shouldn't get another chance because because of what's happened in the past? That are ready to give up on Josh Near? Uh, I just, I mean. It's their choice. If they if they want to give up on me, that's their choice. I mean, I can't do anything about that. Uh, all I can is move on and try to be a better person and try to learn from from uh, from this.